scary movies popular this time of year, and it sort of makes you wonder, why in the world would you go to Crystal Lake? You know Jason's got the hockey mask in the shed. You just don't go into the barn. Or you think you're going to stroll right down Elm Street when Freddy Krueger has that bladed glove, and with Chucky sitting over on the side with a shovel and some plastic wrap, he's luring you to some ledge getting ready to push you off. But all of that would be child's play as opposed to stepping in against a Ted Talk devouring, Swedish fish gobbling, lovable guy of Jordan Davis who used to hide in bathroom stalls to avoid going to football practice because he didn't really want to play. Well, he doesn't hide anymore and there's nowhere to run. One, two, Jordan's coming for you. Three, four, Gators better lock the door. Jordan Davis with the sack. He rips right through two offensive linemen. They slam him to the ground. That's big. Jordan Davis. He was relentless in his effort. The reigning defensive player of the week in the SEC makes the tackle. Size, athleticism, speed. Never going to see nobody like that in the game. See somebody that big running that fast. Fake pitch, drop behind the line. Once again, that's big Jordan Davis. And that's what you call a bull rush. 330 pounds of bullying. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, look out. Oh, my goodness. Jordan Davis with the safety. I didn't even know that, that I was called the scariest player in college football. <laughs> it won't be that friendly when he's getting after Anthony Richardson or Emory Jones today. Jordan Davis has just been phenomenal. He only doesn't even play on third down a lot of times. Is he the guy? Is he the nightmare in Jacksonville for the Gators' scariest player of the game? He is the scariest player in college football. There's no doubt about it. So we, we just covered him. But, okay, this is hitting 20 miles an hour on the GPS at 360. 360. Not 340. Not 340. <laughs> Not 340. <laughs> Look at this dude running down the line. Punks the center, runs down and chases him back. Are you kidding me? Yeah. Yeah. Hitting 20 miles an hour. And the other guy, Daniel. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Fa'a Lele. Baby. Daniel Fa'a Lele. By the way, 6'9", almost 400. Look yeah. at that dude. I mean, are you kidding me? You walk up on that guy, you're like, no, thank you. I don't want any of that. 6'9", 400. 400 pounds. That's why they run the ball. You Everybody don't want that smoke. There. Look at that. I mean, just moves human beings against his will. You don't want none of that. Is it really? Are we making it too complicated, Des? Yeah, I think it's Kayvon Thibodeau. I mean, call him Mr. Tibbs. When you see 6'5", 250 coming off the edge like that, I mean, the guy is so athletic. Oh. We talked to Chip Kelly. He said his get off off the edge is like nothing he's ever seen before. You would think he's offside because he comes across his line of scrimmage so fast. And look at him. He doesn't miss tackles, but he's missed a few games because of injuries. But he's the scariest guy. Hey, look at that guy number eight, Prion Winfrey. I couldn't get my eyes off this guy against Texas. He's all over the field. Mean, reckless abandon. Look at him. Number eight. Can you believe number eight? Wearing number eight in the middle there. Yeah. All over the place. He's, Look at he's all over the field. He's a great football player, boy. <laughs> I like I like Winfrey. He's nice. Nice yeah. player. He is a really good Dude, player. Too. Kirk LC, and I'm not sure about Desmond. We're going to love this guy. You've got to be. Riza, I'm out of here. The punter uh, from San Diego State. <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> You've got to be kidding me, bro. <laughs> he kicked this thing oh, 84 my gosh. yards, sets up his team. I'm going to hang out with this. I'm, 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 I'm done wait, with wait, you. Wait. I, I want you. you to see this. Look at this. Look at this guy going and make a tackle. Ooh. Did you see that power? Bring the fuck, He baby. absolutely wow. broke that dude. Yeah. That's a good return man, yes, too. Exactly. But he's still a punter. So he's, he's a punter. He, he he's count. a punter. Right, right. Right. Here's, here's the guy. Man. Here's the guy. Thibodeau is great. Yep. But yep. Noah Sewell yeah. is 6'3", 260, plays in the middle of that defense, and he is a guy that works sideline to sideline. We just showed you the speed yeah. of some of these bigger guys. This guy's. you got to remind yourself, he's 260, running down backs. He is, to me, by far next level scariest guy out there. Yeah. Elsie, I thought Kirk was with us in appreciating the kicking game. Guy runs down, makes tackles. That can't be scary. He's a punter. He's a punter. He's disqualified. As a punt returner, though, that's disqualified. That's pretty scary. There you go. As a returner.